Welcome to my vlog. This is, uh, if I'm correct, welcome to Long Creek Falls. And it's a two miles walk. It's a two mile walk. Before you get here, it's about, it's about a 10 mile of just trail of off road. So I'm gonna give you the heads up. It's gonna be, kind, it's gonna be quite muddy. Um, unless you come in the, after in the morning, unless you come in the afternoon when the sun is up and shining. But yes, it's gonna be very, very, very muddy. Heads up. Uh, it is a two mile trail, so it's gonna be pretty long. Well, it's gonna be short, but long, same time. Um, it's a creek, so it'll be kind of fun. It's a creek fall. Uh, let's get started. Today's topic of the video, it's gonna be about self-confidence. Top three things to have self-confidence and how to improve them within it. So, see you then. To better self-confidence uh, I felt this personally and I feel like uh, it deals with self-confidence is your income so if you have really low income typically your self-confidence normally goes down because you're always looking at your bank account uh, I don't know you're just aware of the money you're just worried about having the topic about money because I felt insecure back then about me not having money in my bank account I remember when when I was always worried about what I do with my money. I couldn't go and spoil myself because I was always about worried about money. Now it's a little different because I'm working two jobs and my self-confidence is a little bit higher than how it was back then. Back then, I was always worried about was like, oh my god, what am I gonna spend? Where am I gonna spend this? Second rule, it's gotta be self-development. Self-development is improving yourself every day by day. Either that could be improvement by meditating, reading, working out. Don't let society go based on how you wanna be living like. Uh, go based on what you want to have. If you wanna have muscles, work on muscles. If you wanna be skinny, work being skinny. If you wanna be chubby, work on being chubby. You know, it's, it all comes down to preference, but always go by what you want. Self-development, develop yourself to be a better person and a better version of you so your past self would be thankful for you working on yourself. Something that you want to work on, for example, you want to work on getting more experience on the cars, that's self-developing self of getting new experience for it. I gotta say third rule, it's gotta be spend quality time with. I feel like we never have the chance to fall in love with our soul and we look within that with someone else. We depend on so many people in our lives to improve or give us motivation that we really don't take the time to enjoy being alone. And I say this because now I'm spending time alone and I start to value the time that I have and I love it. I have Guys, how I kind of just short clipped it from the hike to here. <laughs> My battery died, unfortunately. I do apologize for that, but I did get some good content for you. Uh, this stabilizer is helping me so much, honestly. Like, I feel a huge improvement compared to like other times that I'm over here wobbling around. But uh, first, le all these lessons that I'm talking about is because I experienced these lessons. I'm not giving it. I'm not going through like notebooks and reading it all. Like, no. I've experienced this myself and I want to bring my experience to y'all because probably my experience can help you improve yourself so be okay with with doing mistakes be okay with um, with looking dumb be okay with oh I fucked up on this 
okay, whatever, improve it, you know? Try to do everyday mistakes so you, the next day you don't do the same mistakes. Try, I'm working really hard to get ahead, and if I can do it, you can do it. Definitely, y'all can do it. Just gotta have faith. Have faith, because hard work will pay off. Trust me. Second, uh, work on yourself. Working on yourself, let's say, for example, I'm giving you this as an example of a house. If you build a house, brick by brick, someone comes to you, it took you two years to build that house, right? Brick by brick, someone comes here, comes to you, hey, I don't like your house, screw you. I don't give two dams about you. I built this brick by brick for you to come and tell me that you don't like my house. <laughs> no, I am not getting rid of my house. I built that involves for you. If you're working yourself day by day, going to the gym, reading, meditating, drinking enough water, taking care of your skin, how are you gonna let someone come to your life and be like, I don't like the way you look and, and feel bad? Come on, of course not. <laughs> Why? Why? You shouldn't be, if you're building yourself every day, just like the house, you shouldn't be worried about what people are judging you because you're working on yourself. That's yourself. This one was kind of hard for me to learn personally because I really recently got into this and it's actually really true i feel like if you spend quality time with yourself you start to fall in love with yourself <laughs> you start to fall in love with you and i feel like you start to enjoy more at alone time and it's very addicting believe it or not it's very addicting i thought it was just like oh people just say it's like to lie or like like yeah it's very addicting but now that i'm actually experiencing myself it's just like meditating but it's not meditating you know because you kind of just reflect on what you're doing it's like am i doing this all right and it's okay to look like weird because you should see me when i'm in a restaurant when i'm by myself i'm over here by myself and there's people looking at me Yo, why is this guy eating by himself, you know? Why is this guy eating by himself? But it's okay, because in this world, this body that you have is the only body you're gonna get. I mean, afterlife, the afterlife, but you gotta enjoy this. You gotta make it your world. You gotta make this an environment where you can be alone. You know, you shouldn't be depending on other people. I mean, there's other stuff that you can have so confidence, but these personal things, these three lessons that I learned myself, that I implemented myself and it boosted my self confidence. This is why I'm bringing y'all my lessons that I learned in my life, probably helping you one of y'all. Anyhow, you guys, that is the end of this video. I hope you like, subscribe for more. Till next time, see you guys.